engineering is anything that has to do with electricity, which obviously is pretty broad. So that can be anything from computers to circuits to everything in between, the lights that go on in your house. As an engineer, you get like a four-year course plan, but as an electrical engineer, a lot of those courses are electives. So you have to choose an emphasis, which means that every electrical engineer, their four-year plan looks different. What I do in electrical engineering is like the computers, so programming and computer architecture, like how to build one. Some emphases are like computer architecture, integrated circuits, signal processing. Well, I've taken some circuits classes, some audio classes, some programming classes, and um, classes that mix all three of those into some design projects. We're working on how to develop better systems for helping drivers, so it's called Autonomous Driver Assistance. And right now our specific project is on lane changing and merging and how we can get a car to recognize a person's specific preferences for driving. One student org within electrical engineering is the IEEE. We also have a couple honor societies and then a couple clubs that I'm in specifically that have electrical engineering elements are this club called Corpus Callosum which mixes art, design, technology and engineering and we're kind of building some projects that take elements from electrical engineering such as you know, an EEG machine which measures people's pulses and brain waves and turning that into something artistic. So I'm actually planning on staying for one more year and getting my master's with the PDP program. And then after that I'm hoping to work in industry. Some electrical engineers in industry are doing um, integrated chip fabrication. Some people are doing uh, control systems like flight control systems. Uh, some people are designing new circuits. Uh, some people are kind of doing uh, power allocation. It really just depends on what your engineering emphasis is.